Yeah, Rick Court, this poor family, as you said, all they were trying to do was make that move from Oregon to Texas, decided to make a stop here in Riverside just to visit family. But instead, that decision ended up costing them thousands of dollars. It was hot and we're from Oregon, so we went to the pool and we were hanging out at the pool for a little bit. And as soon as we were done drying up, I was like, all right, well, you know, let's go go get get our suitcases we'll put all our clothes away i'll hook the trailer up and then you know we'll be ready to hit the road tonight and so i drove to the back where the parking area is and that was when i just noticed that the trailer was just completely gone now take a look at some of the surveillance video that was captured. You see a truck drives the large white trailer off the lot of the Meadows Mobile Home parking lot here in Riverside. Now, unfortunately, the picture is a little grainy, but the family is hoping that someone will recognize the truck who made off with their stolen items. They tell me that person took everything, nearly $80,000 in equipment. Michael McAnally is a mechanic. Now then there's other items that are irreplaceable. There are two kids' baby books, pictures of their family, things that have have sentimental value. In all, they tell me their livelihoods were in that trailer and it all amounted to roughly $100,000. And they've since set up a GoFundMe to help recover some of the costs. Now, again, it all started when the family decided to stop in Riverside on that move from Oregon to Texas. They drove out and arrived here on June 25th and planned to stay about a week. Now, the night before it happened, they spent the day at Disneyland and didn't get home until about 3 in the morning. The family tells me they slept in pretty late. Plus, they had a long drive ahead of them the next day. Well, that day is when Michael later realized that trailer was taken. They say it happened the morning of June 29th between 520 and 530. Do you think that these people knew you were gone at the time? I do. I Yeah, I think I think there was definitely somebody who was paying attention to it. Um, I like I said, I don't know who it is, and it's hard to point fingers, but I it does kind of feel like it was almost like an inside type of job. The way the surveillance was is the person came in, hooked right up, and drove right out. It was literally 10 Not minutes from the time minutes. from the time they drove in the gate until the time they were leaving. They knew that trailer was there, they knew where to go, what kind of truck they were gonna need for it. In order to do that in nine minutes, they had to have known. Now, the family does tell me that they have reported the theft to police, and I reached out to Riverside Police to see if there's any update there. A spokesperson tells me that they are investigating their auto theft detectives, but unfortunately, they haven't been able to recover that trailer yet, and they are still investigating. Reporting live in Riverside, I'm Shelby Nelson. Court Rick, I'll send it back to you.